Welcome to the weather forecast for the UK for the next 10 days. Before we start, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and activate the bell icon to receive updates. According to the latest forecast from the ECMWF, the UK is expected to experience a series of Atlantic depressions and air fronts from tomorrow, Friday, April 12th until Wednesday, April 17th. During this period, moderate amounts of rainfall are expected overall, along with strong wind gusts and a possibility of some snowfall. Now let's delve into more details. Tomorrow, Friday, a rainy air front associated with the southern wall of an Atlantic origin low pressure system passing north of the country will affect most of the Scottish cities and areas, as well as Northern Ireland, the Northern and Western Islands, with a chance of light raindrops in Northern Wales and Northern England. Weather will generally be stable with sunny and warm periods in the rest of the areas. Additionally, the southern wall of the low pressure system is expected to generate strong wind gusts ranging between 30 and 50 miles per hour in wide parts of Scotland, covering most Scottish regions, especially the north, along with the northern and western islands, Northern Ireland, Northern Wales, and Northern England. As we mentioned a little while ago regarding the succession of rainy fronts affecting the UK, another air front will also impact the country next Saturday. However, this front will be more impactful. How so? Firstly, rain will fall over most towns and cities in Scotland, the Northern and Western Isles, and Northern Ireland in generally moderate amounts. However, there are some areas, particularly in the north, shaded in green and yellow on the map, uh, indicating occasional heavy and strong rainfall especially in the presence of strong gusts of wind, which may require some caution. Even Northern England and almost all of Wales this time will experience some light rain. Therefore, this air front is more impactful because it will bring heavier rainfall and also cover wider areas. Secondly, this front may also lead to some snowfall in Scotland, especially inland areas. Important areas that may experience this snowfall include Braemar, Aviemore, Kingasie, Dalwhinnie, Fort Augustus, Tindrum, Tomich, Aknesheen, Ullapool. Thirdly, strong gusts of wind with speeds ranging from 35 to 50 miles per hour will affect all towns and cities in Scottish, Northern Irish, Northern and Western Isles, as well as Northern Wales and Northern England. Important signal regarding temperatures and the distribution of warm and cold air masses. During tomorrow, Friday, and also Saturday, warm air currents from the Atlantic Ocean will continue to push resulting in relatively warm weather during noon hours and also afternoons in many areas, especially in the east, central, and south of England, where temperatures may reach 17, 18, 19, or 20 degrees. However, starting from Sunday, April 14th, the situation will change to the influx of cold air currents from the north, causing a gradual drop in temperatures. A new low pressure system and completely unstable weather are expected next Sunday and also Monday in most areas of the country. Rain is anticipated in all cities and towns with heavier rainfall expected in Scotland and Northern Ireland and mostly light in Southern England and Southern Wales. There is a chance of some snowfall, but mostly light in parts of Scotland, Northern England and Northern Wales. The significant convergence of isobaric lines will result in strong wind gusts ranging from 40 to 55 miles per hour in most areas and cities of the country, except for northern Scotland and the Northern Isles, where winds will not exceed 30 miles per hour. The weather on Tuesday, April 16th will be intermittent, meaning there will be rainy periods and other times of stability with clear and sunny weather. A new air front is expected during Wednesday with light rainfall in most areas, except for southern England, which may not receive any rain. From Thursday, April 18th to Saturday, April 20th, there will be an absence of rain, snow, and strong wind gusts due to the rise of the Azores high pressure system and its strong influence over the UK. Now here are the expected snow accumulations over the next 10 days according to ECMWF model forecasts, between 10 and 25 cm in Ullapool, Dundonnell, Kinlochy, Torridon, Shieldaig, Diabarg, Strathcarran, Stromfurry, Dorney, Gleanelg, Invry, Lokalort, Glenfinnan, Kinlochellan, Balachulish and Dalmally. Between 5 and 15 cm in areas, Keswick, Cummock, Carsfyan, Girvan, Scurry, Kinlochbervie, Lochinver, Paul Bain, Gairlock, Drumbeg, Agnashan, 
Tomich, Laid, Malaig, Tobermory, Stronchen, Fort William, Fort Augustus, Drumna Drushit, Tom Otten, Avimore, Kinusi, Dolwini, Braemar, Bridge of Balji, Tindrum, Inverere, Port Appin, Oban, Crayobhaven, and Loch Gilphead. Less than 5 cm in Landwurst, Barla, Machin Leff, Corwen, Pontred Fendigade, Wigan, Chorley, Preston, Chipping, Burnley, A Cup, Rochdale, Manchester, Glossop, Poynton, Macclesfield, Congleton, Stoke on Trent, Tideswell, Settle, Skipton, Hawes, Lancaster, Sedbur, Kirkby Stephen, Chap, Penrith, Alston, Holt Whistle, Ambleside, Sea Scale, Workington, Carlisle, Newton Stewart, Eyre, Stranra, Kilwinning, Greenock, Killin, Lochraza, Camp Belltown, Bowmore, Scalaseg, Bunessen, Pitt Lockery, Balater, Dufftown, Elgin, Bucky, Aberdeen, Inverness, Rosehall, Kinbrace, Golsby, Better Hill, Thurso, Stornoway, Portry, Balavanic, Cushendun, Colrain, Ballacastle, Cloth Mills, Dungiven, and Omar. Now let's also take a look at the GFS model forecasts.